you want me to do it? Then you can film? Yeah. Right. So who, who are you? Hi, I'm Arthur from the group Tools for Action and now we're gonna test the inflatable barricade with the inflatable cobblestone. We've got six pieces now. We're gonna inflate them with this tiny battery that you can kind of um, put in your underwear. So it's like really small. <laughs> And uh, we're gonna see how long the inflation takes with just one fan. So here I'm gonna do the minus, with the minus, positive with positive. Okay. And what what is that? Where's that? What's that pump from? This is a bilge blower. It's used in boats to extract the water mm -hmm. uh, from this kind of inner inner yeah spaces of a boat. Yeah. 30 euros, you can buy it at Conrad uh, electronic store. Yeah. Brilliant. So, this is uh, the valve. It's originally just um, a plastic uh, bottle used in, uh, just used for vegetables. You can buy it at the supermarket. And, uh, and then, so we cut it up and uh, Used it as well. And it's good that we have got a, a hole of 10 cm diameter so you can inflate much faster and also to get the air out quicker. So that's the reason for the bigger, the bigger uh, inflation holes. Okay. There. Wow, but that, that one was already semi-inflated, yeah? Yeah. Okay. All from that little battery? Yeah. Oh. Okay, that's number Okay, you just started inflating from empty. Wow, that's so quick. If you have more powerful battery that's like 18 voltage, then it will go quicker, of course. But uh, yeah, now we work, work with a very small LED battery that's also not so strong. You're very good on the screen. <laughs> <laughs> Look how quick that is, amazing. And how, si how big are these cobblestones? What's the cobblestone is 140 by 140 by 140 centimeter. Yeah. We've got handles on it and there's Velcro on it so we can attach and detach the different inflatable cubes or inflatable cobblestones. And then we can build structures with it like, for example, barricades or other things. And the nice thing is the silver uh, foil it's used for isolate houses, so it's a building material, it's very cheap, and... Um, insulating, and insulating houses. Yeah, insulating yeah. houses. Yeah. So it's building material, it's very cheap, and uh, yeah, potentially you can, uh, after, after it you can just use it as a shelter or something. Sure. This is uh, only 20 seconds in. It's really quick. Um, while, while you're doing this, what, what's, what's the uh, red line about? The red line is now this visual meme uh, for the um, protest in Paris during the United Nations Climate Global Change Conference. Conference. And it's a uh, red line for a livable, a minimum red lines that are not allowed to be crossed for a livable planet. So um, the idea that we shouldn't get above two degrees global warming, actually not above one and a half degrees global warming, but uh, because it will uh, mess with our ecosystems and uh, we get a lot of different problems with it. One example is also the refugee crisis from Syria. It was climate-induced, five-year-longs of drought. Farmers went to the cities 
got social unrest. Yeah. And uh, uh, the recent terrorist attacks might uh, have to do also with this social unrest. So everything is related. So that look, that first one that was about a minute. Okay. To do that one. I'm, yeah. I'm, I'm going to pause it for a moment yeah. because this is all going to look 